So here's what I did to my Eno Sub 7. It comes with a carabiner on each side, right where that little tag hang down is, right here. It says connect cam here. So you would connect that to the helio straps. But first, you have to put the helio strap onto the tree and slide it through itself. Which, it's fine, but I like to leave my suspension on the hammock. That way if I grab one, I know, okay, your suspension's on there, because I don't want to forget anything I need. So what I did is I took the carabiner off, this is just the, the tail of the Helios. And I actually, where the tag is, that is really blurry. There you go. Um, I actually took the Helio strap and looped it. First, I stuck it through the hole on the Sub 7, right there. And then I looped it through itself, pulled it through, and I took the carabiner and I put the carabiner at the end of the Helios uh, tree hugger. So now, I don't have to take this, loop it through here, bring it down, and then connect my carabiner to the hammock. So now I can literally set it up um, without um, ever taking everything apart. So what I'll do right now is I will take it down, and then I will set it back up to show you how easy it is. Let's back it up. Bane, you're really loud. All right, there he is. Oh yeah, he wants to be real loud. Let me be on camera. All right, all right, but let's set it up. I mean, take it down. So, I always pack the foot end first. I don't know why, and then the head end is what I pack last. So, what's nice is all I have to do now is unclip it, pull it around, and now I can just bring this together Bring it to the center where the bag is. And everything, I already checked, everything fits inside the sub seven bag. So I just start stuffing it in there. And like I said, foot end is last. So now I can just start coming over to the head end. Tuck, 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 tuck. And I do this with most of my hammocks. I have it set so I just pull the head end out first with a carabiner so you don't have to worry about looping it through itself on the tree. You got a bunch of the tail extra here. Undo my carabiner, pull it around. Now, I didn't have to disconnect anything from the, ha the actual hammock. So now I just usually kind of roll that up a little bit. And then I like to leave the carabiner sticking out of the bag, just a hair. So I will finish tucking this. Got it? Okay. Now we're good to tuck. Tuck, tuck, tuck. Pull it around, pull it around. Still got room in the bag. Got the rest of the tail tucked in there. And finally, just bring as much of the strap in there while leaving the carabiner out. Cinch it up, and there we go. And I'm gonna come on the other side of the camera so you can see this. What I like to do is I like to take the carabiner and I just clip it to, whoop, there it is. So now it's ready to go, so I can just carry it by that. Plus that way if I grab by the carabiner and it starts slipping out like this, it only goes as far as the little cord lets me. So now I can take this little guy, find my perfect camping spot, and instead of putting a Helios there, putting a Helios here, stringing it up, I can just do it all at the same time. So I take my carabiner, take the little cord out, pull out just enough to go around the tree, which in this case doesn't need a whole lot. Strap it, pull it tight. And now I actually undo the bag. There's all of my suspension for that side. Look how easy that is. Then I get to the other side. And look, there's the suspension for that side. So I just pull it out of the bag. Keep on coming. 
keep on coming. Boom. Look at that. Okay. Come to this tree. Flip through. Come around. Bring it through the carabiner. And you're done. Just like that. And then you make your adjustment. This side's a little higher. Of course, it needs to be a little higher. Make the berry a little bit. This side, come down. When you got looking good. You're done. There's no more force on the carabiner being against the tree than it is when it's between the hammocks. And it's also plenty strong to hold all its weight. And again, for putting it away, I put the foot end away first and then chuck it all in the bag. So, same thing. Go over here. Undo the carabiner, pull it around. Put all my suspension, kind of ball it up. And then come to the middle and just start tucking it in. So I'll kind of do the same thing. Ball it up a little bit first. Tuck it in the bag. Boom, we're halfway done. Rest of my hammock. Ball it up. Tuck it all in. Nice and tidy. And this is why I have double-ended stuff sacks on some of my hammocks. So I can just open one end, pull it out, and open the other. Then I come up, grab my suspension. Nice and easy off the tree. Start balling everything up together, including the tail. My tail's a little longer on this one, so I will actually put the rest of my tail there. Tuck it in. Leave my carabiner out. Cinch it down. And I'm done. There's my Sub 7 with suspension. All fits in the Sub 7 bag.